there quilting friends, it's Carolina Moore, your favorite sewing and quilting YouTuber and the inventor of the box bag template. And I'm so excited because today I get to launch three new patterns and I can't wait to show these fun patterns to you. You ready? Let's get started. So as you know, last year I launched the box bag template and it is all about being able to cut inset corners and cutting darts on all kinds of projects. It also has this great curve. If you are new to the box bag template, I have a video right here, or you can go down in the description to get the details on that video. So today I want to talk about the patterns that I have that go with a box bag template. Now, if you purchase a box bag template and they're available at quilt shops worldwide, you will get a set of instructions that will show you how to use the box bag template and how to make a simple zippered pouch. But it was really important to me that there are also lots more patterns to go with a box bag template. So I wanted to start with 12 super simple patterns, super, super simple patterns for people to work on making small projects and work on making 3D. There are quilters who have been doing 2D forever and going from 2D to 3D can sometimes be a little bit of a mind shift. And so I wanted to create really simple patterns that would make really fun projects so that you could work on making 3D projects. The goal was to make a dozen of those. When I launched the box bag template, I start out with five and you may be familiar with these five. They were the simple basket, the canvas tote, the bowl cozy, the wine bag, and the cell phone stand. And each one of these is so simple that the instructions fits on the back of a postcard. That's how simple all of these postcard patterns are. All the instructions fit right on a postcard. Plus, it makes them really inexpensive as patterns as well. So I launched these five when I launched the box bag template. And then later that fall, I came out with four more. These were the drawstring pouch, the sewing machine cover, the gift bag, and the roomy stocking. So these were the fall winter kind of inclusions and I wanted to add three more. I knew exactly what they were. I kept trying to find time to work on them and then finally this spring I did find time and so now I get to share them with you and I'm gonna show you the actual projects as well as these fun, fun patterns. So the first was one that lots of people have been asking for, and that was a casserole cozy. And so I have actually two casserole dishes here because I want to show you that this casserole cozy works perfect with a standard nine by 13 casserole pan. But if you have one of these big lasagna, these deep lasagna pans, it also works great as a lasagna pan. So this is a casserole cozy. And here's the pattern for the Castrol Cozy. Also super simple, all the instructions fit on a postcard. And yeah, it's just, it's a great, really simple pattern. So versatile, you'll want this for all your Castrol dishes, for all your potlucks that we get to go to this summer. Okay, so there's the Castrol Cozy. The next was in that same vein. And that is this pie cozy. This pie cozy is super cute because when you make it, it doesn't just sit like this. You actually tuck up these little corners so that you get like a two color look, kind of like a flared look to your pie. And this is the pie cozy. So here's a picture with it having an actual pie in it and it'll help keep your pies warm, help you transport those pies. Again, a super simple pattern. This is the pie cozy. And the third one is one that as soon as it was recommended to me, hey, have you thought about making this? I could not get this idea out of my mind. And anyone that I've mentioned it to said, um, yes, yes, we need this in our lives. And that is this silly little thing right here. This is a pint cozy. So get your favorite pint. In this case, obviously I don't have ice cream in here because I don't want ice cream in my studio, but get your favorite pint of ice cream and it'll tuck right in here. And now you can keep your hands warm and your ice cream cold while you're enjoying your favorite frozen treat. So any 
ice cream pints should fit beautifully right in there. And then you can enjoy your pint at your leisure, regardless of the heat outside and without getting your hands cold. Okay, so that is this pattern right here, the ice cream cozy. So those are my now 12 patterns. Ice cream cozy, pie cozy, and casserole cozy are all new. I have my roomy stocking, the gift bag, the sewing machine cover, the drawstring pouch, and then of course the original five, the wine bag, the cell phone stand, the bowl cozy, the campus tote, and the simple basket. So we now have 12 postcard patterns that go with the box bag template, in addition to the pattern that comes with the box bag template. And now that I have these simple patterns, and what I mean by simple patterns, uh, these patterns have no buttons, no zippers, no snaps, no hardware of any kind on these. Now that we have these 12 patterns out, I'm working on patterns that have hardware, that have zippers, that have buttons, that have snaps, that have all the gorgeous like bag jewelry that we use when making bags. And it's gonna be so fun to get to play with these things. So these 12 patterns are now out. Check with your local quilt shop about them or go down to the description for details where you can buy them directly from me and get started with your box bag template. If you don't have your box bag template yet, make sure that you get your box bag template because it makes bag making and really so many 3D projects so fabulous. All right, friends, that's what I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you're subscribed to this channel. If you have any questions or comments, leave those down below and make sure that you like this video so people know that they need to know about all these fun box bag template patterns. That's all I have for you today, my friends. I will see you right here real soon. Bye for now.